four WPDE All Zone selections, inking with Division I schools, headline signing day 2012. The South Carolina Gamecocks scooped up Dillon wide receiver Quinton Smith. The six foot four, 200 pounder turned down offers from all the big name schools, including Alabama, LSU, Florida, and Notre Dame to sign with the Gamecocks. Smith had 10 touchdown catches at Dillon his senior year. He is also an excellent return man. Well, we're trying to make history. So um, the group of guys that's there now and the group of guys that's coming, uh, we feel like we got a good chance of making history there. Hemingway wide receiver Jabril Solomon has signed with the East Carolina Pirates. Solomon was an early commitment and never wavered from his choice. Solomon is excited to be a part of the Pirates' up-tempo offense. What have they told you your freshman year? Are you going to play right away? Yes, sir. They told me I'll be able to play right away. I'll start my uh, summer sessions over the summer, and then I'll work out with the team, and I'll be able to play my freshman year. Myrtle Beach had two Division I signings. Defensive end Tyler Knox is on his way to the ACC to play for the North Carolina State Wolfpack. Like when I went up there, they showed me lots of love. They got an academic program. I got to know the coaches real well, and they got to really know me, like an understanding point and everything, and I'm ready to be up there right now. Myrtle Beach offensive lineman T.J. Jones committed to the Kentucky Wildcats just before the start of his senior year. Today, he made it official. I'm going to study business. Wow. In terms of what long term, what do you want to be when you grow up? Well, I'm going to own me a business. Seahawks Shrine Bowler Dequarius Wilson signed with the North Carolina Central Eagles to make it a Myrtle Beach trio on signing day. Also on the Grand Strand, four Carolina Forest Panthers signed letters of intent and Conway had three players ink with Newberry College. I think any coach uh, wants to see his kids get opportunity and that's kind of what I told them early. It's an opportunity for them and, and that means that, that they've got to step through the door and, and get the job done and I think they will. Don't forget, tonight at 7.30, News Channel 15 Sports will air a 30-minute special on signing day. To see all the signings, including interviews with the players, log on to carolinalive.com and click on sports. Covering signing day, Mark Haggard, News Channel 15 Sports.